Hey guys, what's going on today? It's Coldplay's here, and today uh, I'm going to be playing some more World of Warcraft. Um, it's been a little, yeah, it's been like two days, I think, since my last video. Um, so pretty much I've been mostly kind of working on my druid since then. Uh, I haven't leveled too much. I have actually leveled up my monk a little bit more. Uh, I have him at, he's not 92 quite yet, he has a few bars till 92, but he does have his level 2 garrison going and all of that up and going. But um, pretty much today I just wanted to go ahead and talk about what I've been, or kind of my progress on my druid and kind of how my garrisons are all set up. So pretty much my first thing is that I do actually have, I've actually done this today, I got some PvP gear. Uh, I'm just going to switch to my PvP gear, equip that, and I'll show you. I got this, which is a uh, offhand level 620, uh, which is 675 in PvP. I got this helmet, which is 606, uh, that, this, and this. So I got a little bit of gear. I am doing, or I am doing a balance while I am, uh, while I'm doing PvP and just as an off spec. Um, but whenever I do go ahead and start getting conquest gear, I will be getting that in retrospect so I can actually use that in like my raids and stuff. Uh, as long as I don't use trinkets, I should be fine. Um, so I'm pretty much just going to show you kind of the daily stuff I've been doing and stuff like that. Uh, as you can see, I have hardly any garrison resources. Uh, pretty much, I'm just for now, I'm literally only doing my garrison resources and anything else that I kind of just need to do. Because I'm really low on garrison resources. I do want to upgrade my Lunar Fall in. I just got that. I replaced my barn with it. Mostly because leather, it's not that expensive. And it's really not worth it unless you're making Savage Blood. And I quite, or I wasn't quite yet to that point. Um, so I probably will do that on another character. But for this guy right now at least, I need to just go ahead and focus on trying to get my followers up. And trying to get as much garrison resources as I can. So I'm working on that. Oh yeah, uh, I will show you my followers. I have a 624 Zuri Ock, uh, 616 of him. And then I think I have this guy working in my enchanter, or my enchanting place. Uh, this chick working in my leatherworking place. And then I have a 645 Broom of Swift Stone. I really just used that because I got a 645 armor and weapon upgrade just straight up. So I figured why not use it on her. And then this is my next best, and then I have Fender. I actually need to look up who's the best and like who I should be doing this with. Because right now I'm just kind of just throwing them around. Not that worried about it. Um, but yeah. Also, what else? Um, I'm going to show you. I have um, this thing, which is a Dwarven Bunker. I have that over here. What do I have in here? Just some scraps. I have a Salvage Yard, I think it's called. Right there, my leatherworking thing right here. Now I'm lagging a little bit. Um, I'll go ahead and refill that. And since I have her working there, I get two for the price of one, which is awesome. And then I have a little enchanter thing over here, mostly just because I need more enchanting supplies. So I figured I also have it on my shaman now. So I have pretty much three for the price of one. Or really four because this guy counts technically as two so that's awesome so besides that um, for whatever reason I have this here um, I might get rid of my lumber mill because I'm not really using it oh never mind I literally I don't even know what happened I thought I was on my death knight for a second I don't even know but yeah I do actually use that um, and then I have my herb garden which is level two and then level three mine that's really about it for my garrison on this guy. So I'm really, right now, my goal on my garrison would be to go ahead and get my Lunar Fall, blah, Lunar Fall up to level 2, which I sh should. Um, where are my garrison resources at right now? Alright, I'm at 234. So, let me see. Do I have any current ones? I do not. Um... And 27, no, I'm going to have to wait until about 9 o'clock my time and hope that this works. 26%, but if I get it, that's 525, which is quite a bit. So I'm really, really, really hoping that I get that. If not, that sucks, but, you know, it is only 26%. So if not, I'll probably get that within a few days or so. But 
or not a few days, but I'll have it tomorrow for sure. Um, where is it at? Winterfall Inn. I will go ahead and buy it, since I know I want it for sure. Might as well. Yeah, wrong thing. Um, also, since last, I have gotten a new weapons. I don't even know if I've actually even been on this guy made the video, to be honest. But uh, I've gotten the Hoof of uh, Yalnu and this offhand. Uh, they're not the best. They're only heroic dungeons, but they do have sockets, which is pretty good. And they both have mastery, which is alright, but haste is better. This one actually has haste, so that's actually a really good offhand for me. Uh, I do need a new trinket. After I place this trinket, I will pretty much be set in terms of uh, not having to do heroics besides um, just like once every now and then for or once to get my ring or whatever. Um, what is this? Oh, it's just for my raid. I will be raiding on Tuesday and hopefully I'll be able to raid on Thursday. I don't see why I wouldn't be able to. Ah, uh, I need 70 more. Um, besides that... Uh, I haven't been doing too much. I actually stocked up on a lot of these. Which kind of sucks, because that was probably like an hour or two. And I don't even have it anymore. Oh! I got some stuff over here. Let me see. How much do I got? Oh, only 20. Uh, I do actually need to get this up to level 3. I also need resources for that. Yeah, I need a lot of resources. So hopefully that level, or that 25% mission will go through. If not, that's going to suck. Okay, so... Um, if you guys didn't know, I do play Restro, normally when I raid and stuff, that's my, uh, main spec. And, so yeah, I just off-spec balance, because it's used similar gear, so it's not that bad. But yeah. Alright, but, um, if you guys are curious, uh, on my Death Knight, I do have my, uh, trading post for any extra resources I have. I'm going to pause it because the dogs are barking. So yeah, uh, my death knight, I have a trading post for extra resources. I have my professions, which would be uh, blacksmithing and jewel crafting on my mage. I have, uh, what do I have on my mage? I have a barn, which I'm probably going to get rid of because I'm, I think I'm just going to buy this stuff because it's really not that expensive. Like, it's like 24 gold daily to keep to keep up with it, and that's just, eh, like 50 gold at max daily. That's just really not that bad, to be honest, and I'd prefer to just buy it instead of wasting something that I could have. Let's just look at the mediums. Like, I mean, I could have a trading... I mean, really, it's not that bad if you think about it, but, like, I'd rather have a Lunar Fall in at least on this guy, and maybe I'd probably have my... Gladiator, Gladiator Sanctum on my Death Knight, maybe? I don't know. But yeah, that'd be that'd be alright. Um, If I had more resources, I would get rid of my Lumber Mill. If I ever get set, I'll probably get rid of my Lumber Mill and have a Gladiator Sanctum. I'm not sure, though. That would take a little bit until I'd be ready to do that. Um, But, yeah. I do want to get my Salvage Yard going on my other guys eventually. That'd be nice. Um... Well, besides that, guys, I think that's about it for this video. Go ahead and like the video, subscribe, and go ahead and leave me some feedback, guys. See you guys next time on my video channels, stuffs, you know, whatever. Um, thank you guys for watching.